Suppose you have to convert some amounts into a different currency. Now you can do this in Google Sheets using the Google Finance function. And it can actually look up the date, look up the currency rate as of a certain date as well. We're not going to do that. We're just going to look at it right now. Think about how you would do this. Convert US dollars to Canadian dollars or to Australian dollars or to the British sterling pound. You'd have to look it up and then do a currency conversion online or something. A bit messy, right? So what you can do is just do this. You go Canadian equals that amount. That's what I want to convert. So here's an easier way to do it. You can use the Google Finance function. And here's how you do that. You go, I want to multiply this. This is my base figure in US dollars. And so I'm going to go equals that amount there. That's all there times Google Finance. And then what I want to do is double quotes. I want to say it's currency that I want to do. Colon, what I'm converting from, US dollars. What I'm converting to, Canadian. And now as soon as I hit that, done. Now I can copy that formula just by clicking here and it will convert all of these down here as well. If I hit double click here, it has converted them all. But what about if you want to go from US dollars to Australian dollars? Same thing again, except we're changing the currency times Google Finance currency colon USD AUD and then I mark this double click and so that's converting from the US dollars through to Aussie dollars and now what about the British pounds and by the way I have formatted these cells differently so I've gone up to format by the way I have formatted these cells differently because they're not going to have the dollar sign in front of them and the way to do that is I go format number and then we're going down to more formats I've actually got British pound sterling there because I've just used it before but I'm going to show you here more currencies and then I can select whichever currency that it is that I want or well, the one that I want is the British pound sterling and I apply that and there's the pound symbol but now we still have to do the conversion, so let's do that. And here's where I say I want to go from US dollars to Great Britain pounds. And once again, I can double click or just drag and drop to get the conversion. And so then, if I need to change the price of this service, and that's going to say $3,000, watch what happens to all of these. $3,000 US, as soon as I hit enter, it converts them all. So that's it, Google Finance, and look up the details to make sure that you are getting the exchange rate that you want how Google calculates the exchange rate and Google Sheets using the Google Finance function can look up historical currency uh, conversion rates.